Hello, in this video we are going through everything about the website. So as you can see this is the website Redneck Robber. On the first page at the very beginning we have four pictures and underneath this slideshow here, actually the sliding, uh, we'll see the uh, paintings dropping down. And then we have the video right here, when anybody click on that it will start right away. So I'll stop that for now. So when I go down, I have the sticky menu following me down with the logo, uh, which is halfway down, and also all the things right up here. So I'll go down a little bit more. So we have this uh, section says what we do. So these cartoons I made and I added into the website of waterproofing, roofing, uh, rocket science, and proof we are redneck. So by clicking on any one of them, it will be taken to the page uh, as we have them at the top as well. Uh, under applications, boring detail, and everything else, which I'm going to go uh, one by one quickly. So then we have uh, another section where, where I put this picture on the left side, and easily you are able to change all the text on the right side. And as you as you know, you can change everything on this page, everything, even all this and uh, uh, the title of each one of them you can change. I'm going to go uh, very quickly on on that as well on this video. And then uh, we have this section of some of the works or basically like uh, what you can do exactly. And then we have some extra text of what you're going to write here. And the latest products, uh, which is automatic, every time when you put, uh, when you add some products, they're going to come here. I mean, the latest uh, are going to come on the first page. And I can also make it uh, the way only the random products uh, will be shown here. That means every time anybody comes to the website, they'll see some new products. And by clicking on show more, they'll be taken into the store page uh, to see all the products, which I'm going to go there too. So underneath the website, we have the contact us section of two beautiful cartoon homes. And underneath that, the grass and this guy's walking on the grass, uh, like like uh, came out from the door here and then taking the dog for a for for a uh, for a trip or something. So we've got the hours. I have this contact section on all the pages so anybody want to speak immediately ask for order or whatsoever they can communicate here instantly and then we have the phone number and email address so uh, when I go up uh, we, I added this about us page to write something about the website like what you guys are doing so as you know you can easily change the photo and also add uh, any text on the right side so beside that we've got application so it, it it is divided into two sections roofing and waterproofing and as you know you can easily add the text into each one of them right here and the waterproofing again the same thing um, add the text because each one of them they have the different content you can have pictures you can have and text uh, as easy as the same exact previous website and the same thing happens onto this two tabs right here Rocket Neck Science and uh, Proof Your Redneck. So it's the same thing. And then I have the free code, which uh, is just something I was thinking maybe if you want it, so I can have the tap, but I'll take that out for now. So you won't see that. And the store. That's the cool part. So we've got the uh, card compare list, which I'm going to take that out, and the shopping cart. So by clicking on the store itself, or the show more on the home page, it will be taken to this page. So this is the category number one as a sample. Remember, whatever you see here is just a sample. So we have we can have up to many different categories. Let's say waterproofing uh, something. So it's a different category and waterproofing something else could be a different category as well. So let's say right now I have only one category which is called product and you can see that on the product categories we have only products. So I just put everything for now underneath this category, the one I made uh, quickly with the sample photo. And when I click here, I'll be able to see all the products I have on the website for now, which is only five, but you can have as much as you want. And the good feature about this is beside uh, people can buy them online, they can just simply come here and visit and read about the products. So as I said, everything here is the 
is just a sample so right now we've got let's say this one so I can quickly add it to the card the quantity I want or in case I need more detail because this is the short description I put here but if I need more detail I click here and I see a longer description of uh, what's a, what what exactly going on about the product before I purchase so I clicked here right now and let's see what's happening next so we're in the page uh, of the detail of the product so here is the full description everything you're able to simply uh, for any product very very easily just like posting something on Kijiji you can add uh, a new product so here is, this is the price and I can email it to a friend I can download the whole thing as a PDF uh, let's say when you're with a customer or anything like you can download it uh, as a PDF you can send this to a friend uh, ask them to buy or something so for now I'm gonna go to of this item and press add to cart as you can see I can go next and uh, previous uh, to see the product because everything here is a sample so the products I didn't put um, uh, the quantity in the back end how many I have but uh, I'll show you in a separate video how everything works and as I said in order to put a new product into the website it takes about a minute of each if you have the contents ready if you have the text ready so I can create coupons and uh, the coupons can be sent to your clients for purchasing something with a percentage of discount or a fixed amount of discount so right now I made the system to check out with even though I don't have the product in stock but I click the checkout just to quickly show you what's going on next so oh it's not allowing me unfortunately because uh, I, I did not probably set it the way it go through but the next section uh, is gonna be just the details and at, right after that uh, we'll have uh, the payment section well so I uh, quickly stopped the video and uh, put uh, I made the change in the uh, quantity of that thing so as you can see I'm back into the home page under store under my shopping cart I have this item already here two of this and the total is thirty six dollars because I made eighteen dollars for the price so I click checkout to go back to the previous page so the maximum amount of order is one so just because I I have another uh, setting up back there but you're not gonna have any of this because these are just some tests I made so I put it for this sample for this video test I make it one press update the card so everything is good to go I press the checkout button because I have no coupons and right here it is asking me if I'm a registered account if I have a registered account or I'm guest but for for the website we're gonna have everybody as a guest we're not going to allow anybody to register because that is gonna be a different story so let's say as a guest for now I click the continue button so here I fill up all, everything just something I put here quickly and then the telephone number city postal code country let's go for Canada and the region I go Ontario and address alright so my delivery and billing address are the same so because the next step if I don't click this the next step is gonna ask me the same thing uh, just because I didn't check that thing so I go back to the edit section and I press this button and press continue and as you can see I'm automatically uh, into this section now so we have different options of shipping you need to let me know what type of shipping you want like right now I put a flat rate of ten dollars uh, this is as a test only everything here is is only a test like uh, we charge ten dollars extra uh, for the shipping and the money will be going to your pocket for now let's say I select uh, the flat rate of ten dollars because we can have different options like Express whatever so but they're mostly flat rate so or we can divide it into inside Ontario outside Ontario inside the GTA outside of GTA or things like that and have different uh, flat rate pricing so for now I select the ten dollars I go next the step five as you can see is the payment method so the step five as you can see is the payment method so for now I have two things PayPal and Stripe I'm gonna change the stripe into credit card so it's gonna show credit card 
in case if anybody have a, co a coupon they can still apply it here but if let's say they don't they select a credit card imagine this is saying credit card any comments if they have they write it here and then they go to the net last section so the last section they put their credit card information you need to create a uh, stripe account which is very simple it takes less than three to four minutes uh, and uh, you have to just provide me the user and password and I'll connect it to your uh, Stripe account. When the payment, the transaction is completed, when they press the confirm order, this is the last time they check everything they want, including the subtotal, flat shipping rate they have selected, uh, the quantity, the model 14, which I put it in the back end and everything. When the order is confirmed, you will receive a text, oh sorry, an email instantly of the order is being purchased and uh, the money will be sent into your uh, Stripe account. So that's all.